Hi there, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing episode number eight of Buffy the Vampire Slayer season four. It's called Pangs. I've actually just done a kind of a, a review, let's say, of the two episodes I've watched off camera of Angel. I'm probably going to stick that in the Angel outro or the reaction to episode eight of Angel and that outro. I actually filmed the whole thing with the Buffy uh, background. <laughs> I've just realized. Never mind. Um, but yeah, if you're interested in that, if you're watching my angel reactions, I'll be doing that. I'll probably put a little text insert to let you know about that in that uh, reaction anyway. But yeah, this uh, Buffy show has kind of got out of control in the last episode. It's gone a bit crazy. Um, during that whole reveal of what's going on and um, yeah, they've got some sort of facility. I didn't say it because I didn't want to ruin the reaction, but I was thinking, mm, not sure. I'm not sure about this. It's got a little bit crazy. Um, but it's really interesting and intriguing still because we still don't know what they're doing. But I was like, oh my God, really? Is this, is this Buffy anymore? Is, is, what's happened here? Because I know someone told me that some people left the show or stopped. Did they stop viewing it? I don't know, but they don't go back to view it, let's say, after season three. And so far in season four, I have wondered why that was because it's been really good. However, that episode did make me think, ah, Maybe that's why. Maybe they weren't happy with this and maybe it goes down this road from now on. And it's a completely different show, right? Maybe. But I did enjoy it. I enjoyed the episode and I enjoyed that whole reveal and I thought it was a really good episode. Yeah, but it's very different, isn't it? And how is it going to change things going forward? So there's a little bit of kind of worry there for me, a little bit of apprehension. But I trust it. I trust the show makers that they're not going to spoil this show. And maybe it's for another reason. Maybe it's just the first three seasons for some people were just better seasons. I don't know. But so far, like I've said, it's been really good. You can let me know what you thought of that. I did want to mention that during the outro to that one, but yeah, I didn't. I forgot. Yeah, let me know what you thought of that and whether you had the same feelings as I have or had. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I'm looking forward to this one. It's called Pang. So yeah, I'm imagining this is Spike. Hunger Pangs, right? He's going to be, yeah, desperate for, well, blood. But I still think he can drink it, but just not bite someone to drink it. But I might be wrong. Surely, because, yeah, they implanted him before. I'm still not sure what happened with that bag. Because the blood was empty. Where was the blood? If he didn't drink it, because he was faking it, where was the blood? What did he do with it? Doesn't make sense. <laughs> so maybe he drunk it because he's such a powerful vampire, he could survive it. But you think they'd know that and they'd give him a higher dose or something. Anyway, I don't know what happened. Let me know what, you th what happened to that blood. But yeah, I'm looking forward to this. Looking forward to see how Spike deals with this and whether he's going to survive or not and what's going to happen with him so yeah let's get to it oh is this that scene where doyle had the vision at the end of the last angel episode Wait, what do you want <laughs> oh. does she know he's a vampire oh yes <laughs> okay and they say one person can't make a difference <laughs> hmm? i thought she was going to get in trouble here because he had that vision oh maybe she is is there more than one what's up Oh, oh, they're here because it right. So they're here. Be, Angel's here. They're all the here, I guess. Excellent. Can't wait. Why was he hiding from her? Okay. Oh, God, I'm so pleased. We're going to get. I thought it was going to be ages. If he was going to return, I thought we were going to have to wait a long, long time. But yeah, this soon. I'm really happy that they're doing this with both shows. I really am. It was the one wish I had really about this Angel show. And after Angel went out of it, right? I feel a bit, little bit silly now after the way I reacted when Angel officially <laughs> left Buffy. Because I was convinced that that was it for him. I really was. I guess at the time it was an okay reaction because how was I to know? Probably everyone had a similar reaction. <laughs> I think she made so you Xander. Oh, what? Very Xander work in construction now. So much sexier than the outfit from his last job. What's his attempt job? having sex with him. Right now, if you will. <laughs> it's about one culture wiping out another. Squandu takes a musket ball in the stomach. <laughs> okay, now for some of that, you were channeling your mother? Well, yeah, sort of. I mean, that's why she doesn't celebrate Thanksgiving. Is that what Thanksgiving is? A celebration? Oh, it's a weird word, but of that. I've always wondered. You kill and eat an animal. It's a ritual sacrifice with pie. With pie? <laughs> Xander said he was going to dig. I want to see Xander dig. Oh, look, there he goes. Bless him. There he goes. <laughs> look at him. Very diggy. 
Dicky. <laughs> Soon you'll be sweating. I'm imagining having sex with him again. Imaginary sure. is quite the machine. <laughs> oh, it's full of sinkhole. What is this place? What's he found? <laughs> it's like we're going back to when he first showed up. Earlier you agreed with me about Thanksgiving. It's a sham. It's all about death. Well, I suppose there could be slight yams. <laughs> we could not invite Anya. <laughs> I don't know. No. <laughs> Wow, he's looking pale. You have to find some blood from somewhere. <laughs> I kind of feel sorry for him. <laughs> oh. You're on his trail. As long as he knows about the initiative, he's a threat. We do this the professor's way. Yeah, I guess Spike would tell all the other vampires, or would he? He's kind of selfish, Spike. I don't think he cares about the others. I went to watch you digging, and you weren't there doing it. Where is it about this digging? I'm going now. Just kind of tough getting going today. Oh, you has he got some sort of fever from this? Oh, you're sick. <laughs> Anya. You're pasty and wet. Just looking after her now. They can dig without you. <sighs> In a way, this is kind of Xander's dream, isn't it? Having someone dote on him, well, even if it is a former demon. You could catch it. We'll die together. <laughs> Jesus. Romantic. <laughs> Romantic. <laughs> you're a strange girlfriend. Yeah. Ooh. I'm a girlfriend? No. <laughs> no. Whatever it is that's making you sick, so far I like it. <laughs> oh my god. What is this then? It's got into Xander, I guess. Ooh, some sort of green smoke. Right, it's okay. her doing the speech, okay. right? Oh. 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 Is this like the Inca mummy thing? He's gone. <laughs> right, so he's like reawakened the past, I guess. The coroner's office said she was missing an ear. Jesus. There's some great spells that work much better with an ear in the mix. <laughs> That's one fun little hobby you've got there, Will. Yeah. It's like building another demon completely out of ears. Building. <laughs> what the fuck? The ear demon. So she brutally stabbed herself. Yeah. Dumped the body and then cut off her own ear? Seems likely. No. She cut off her ear, then killed herself, then dumped the body. I'm really off my game, aren't I? <laughs> Some sort of Indian artifact. Shumash, I think. That's all we got. Oh, Shumash Indians. Oh, of course, Indian, Native American, right. This is Thanksgiving, isn't it? Okay. Of course. She sounds good. Oh. Kind of intense oh. about this Thanksgiving thing. Why has he gone to Giles know, first? She's a little lonely. No, if she knew I was here, I, look, it would distract her, it could get her hurt. I don't, okay. I don't want it to get in the way. Tell me they're going to see each other though. I want them to see each other. Maybe it was trapped there and now it's released. Something mm. has a fondness for ancient weapons. You know Father Gabriel? No. He knows the history of this place pretty well. He's <laughs> <laughs> oh. just rubbing it in his nose now. <laughs> his little face like a puppy. Riley. No. Where did you come from? I didn't see you at all. Oh, just across the street. Just from hunting. Look, they're selling coffee in the coffee shop. Yum. <laughs> Tell her, help her. If she sees me, it'll be worse. Uh, see, well, I was gonna I have to keep this that. from Buffy. All this, this leaving for her own good garbage. There's obstacles. Do you know what kind of? Willow. <laughs> Sorry, my stuff. <laughs> you know how I feel about her. Hey, is Cordelia really working for you? I mean, cause that's gonna be a special experience. And all the people <laughs> it really is. Hired, well. She kind of hired herself. If you can just tell me, who's that guy? When I was a kid, oh, no. only without me building a fort out of my mashed potatoes. You know, if you don't already have plans, she invited him. Hmm? I'm a great cook, in theory. I've eaten a lot. That sounds so <laughs> great. Home's the place that, when you have to go there, they have to take you in. Get out! But babe, this is where <laughs> I belong. Out! I mean it. I've you been burnt all your shit, reading. Spike. Doing a lot so of reading. <laughs> yes, no. I do. <laughs> I do. He's just gonna use her to get her to get blood for him. No. And you're mean. <laughs> you let that in our bed. <laughs> you let that in our bed. <laughs> Can I have someone to eat? <laughs> That's what he's here for. 
Oh. Oh, is that the fuck? For the avenging spirit to carve out justice. Justice for Europeans taking his land, I guess. And killing a load of his people. <laughs> you slaughtered my people. Hmm. Now you kill their spirit. Oh. Oh. He turned to bats there. Okay, so that's the end of the father. I had the guy, I was ready for the takedown, and I stopped. Why did he let her off the hook, American. by the way? Sorry? We don't say Indian. Still try not to refer to you lot as bloody colonials. <laughs> I do want to stop him. I just like to find a non slay way to do it. non slay way. I got the full poop on the Shumash Indians in our oh. fabulous buried mission. You said you were going to get fresh ones. Atrocities? Peas, they come <laughs> little pods, you were going to shell them. They were fluffy indigenous kittens to weep. To... <laughs> They're going to be mushy. They won't be mushy. I like mushy peas. Goes well with fish and chips, actually. I love fish, chips, and mushy peas. They were killed. Men, women, and, and children. And for proof to bring back to their accusers. They cut off their ears. Oh, okay. So Hoos wasn't kidding about the rightful vengeance routine. He's recreating all the wrongs done to his people. Jesus, man, that's horrific. Well, okay. Oh, that's the, but we should the spirit. It changes Bring to different the animals, though. The light. I think you just want to slay the demon, then go la la la. And I think your, your, your sympathy for his plight has blinded you to certain urgent facts. Unfeeling guy. Oh, well, no, that's not fair. Unfeeling guy. <laughs> I saw him, too. Well, that's not terribly stealthy of him. I think he's lost his edge. <laughs> but Buffy doesn't know. Xander. You look like death. Are you okay? You didn't bring rolls? Since Xander released this thing, is it... If they cure Xander, will it get rid of this guy, maybe? I don't know. Is Xander kind of helping him manifest like this? List the various... Various? As in... <laughs> He's got multiple different diseases. Malaria, some smallpox. I was going to say smallpox. <laughs> you know. Syphilis, but basically... Standard Syphilis. Standard. Syphilis. <laughs> <laughs> and you won't mind. Let's give him some land. I'm sure that'll clear everything right up. <laughs> Sarcasm accomplishes nothing, Giles. Can we come rocketing back to the part about me and my new syphilis? <laughs> my new syphilis. But it won't kill you. <laughs> the smallpox will. <laughs> Maybe there's there's a Wiccan spell. Salt. Onion? That's the stuffing. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh. What, so he rises up and infects the first guy he sees? Mm -hmm. That's no fair. Like you've never woken up cranky? You don't talk to vengeance demons. You kill them. <laughs> I didn't know you felt that way. We're trying to understand this one, Anyway, Sander. he's a spirit. Oh, okay, Anya. You really demon don't know has what to do what a demon has to Again do. with the killing! Oh. A demon has to do what she has to do. Well, you know that I didn't it's mean right you. I don't think anyone finished. appreciates the truth of the situation. Oh, I think we do. It needs more condensed milk. <laughs> that was a really good scene. Hatred is a cycle. All he will do is kill. Who else did she invite? Help me. Oh, Spike! Come to them for help! What the part of help me do you not understand? The part where I help you. Yeah. Come on, I'm, I'm pop boiling out here. <laughs> Want me to help make it quicker? <laughs> invite me in! No. <laughs> it's like an old crone. Oh, yeah, like <laughs> <laughs> Willow, tell them what I did. You, you said you were going to kill me, then Buffy. But it doesn't mean. <laughs> yes. <laughs> doesn't mean they want to help you. He had trouble performing. Yeah. Well, <laughs> it looks like they've done me for good. Spike had a little trip to the vet, and now he doesn't the chase the other puppies anymore. <laughs> can't bite anything. Let's be best pals. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I've got information. What's he expecting here? About the soldier boys you were fighting. Oh. Got the inside scoop. Hmm. Did he catch any of their names? Walk with me upon a Tiashu again. Uh oh. Is he summoning some Hear of his buddies? Oh dear. Sunny Dale's going to be full of Native Americans looking for revenge. Revenge. Mm -mm. <laughs> but Thanksgiving. <laughs> Get that out of the way first. Bloody hell, woman. You're cutting off my circulation. They don't trust him. You don't have any circulation. Well, oh, yeah. it pinches. <laughs> I wouldn't say no to a brandy. What's wrong? <laughs> Victims. I mean, apart from Xander, who's his targeted authority figures? Buffy, this isn't a Western. We're not at Fort Giles with the cavalry coming to save us. It's one lonely guy. It was. It's about five or six now. Someone put a stake in me. You got a <laughs> lot of volunteers in here. 
<laughs> I just can't take all this mamby pamby boo hooing about the bloody Indians. Uh, the preferred term is. You won, all right? You came in and you killed them and you took their land. That's what conquering nations do. That's what Caesar did. And he's not going around saying, I came, I conquered, I felt really bad about it. <laughs> the history of the world is not people making friends. You had better weapons and you massacred them. End of story. Well, I think the Spaniards actually I mean, did a lot of. Doesn't make it right. Not that I don't like Spaniards. It's kill or be killed here. Take your bloody pick. Maybe it's the syphilis talking, but some of that made sense. I made a lot of these points earlier, but you know, it's fine. No one <laughs> Look, fine, okay, but someone still has to go warn the dean. It looks like he's ready to drop any minute, and I think I can eat someone if he's already dead. I'm up to it. <laughs> yeah. um, we'll keep on looking for a solution. It's gonna be a nice, quiet, civilized. You. Why does he come here specifically? Should be going after the dean, right? What's going on? <laughs> it isn't working. Uh, you can have casinos now. <laughs> Careful, Spike. He could. That arrow would be like a stake for his part. What about me? You gonna leave me like this? <laughs> it's a sitting duck. Oh. Hey, what's the heart? Ooh, just missed it. <laughs> so this is Angel. He's large and flowery, isn't he? <laughs> He's evil again. I, I'm, I'm not evil again. Why does everyone think that? <laughs> Angel's here to protect Buffy. He's a warrior. To a warrior, the leader means the strongest fighter. Oh. Oh, the strongest fighter. Oh, okay. It's not the Dean, it's Buffy. Right, that makes more sense. Do you need a plan? Yes, let's talk about it some more. <laughs> <laughs> He's quite calm given the situation. I think he'd prefer death than to live as a skeleton. Buffy. Oh, shit. Go for her arm. Oh, fuck. Remember that conquering nation thing? Forget it. Apologize. Oh, shut up, Spike. Fine, I'll do it myself. Hey, sorry. <laughs> sorry about that. He team. could fix this. If he gets through to him. Oh my god. Got a bit ET. <laughs> <laughs> Stop them. Oh my god, son, get out of there. What are you waiting for? <laughs> really? Those two against the warrior. These boys never fought anyone like Buffy back in the day. Ow. <laughs> hell. Can they be killed? Though? Yes, not. Oh shit. Giles, these guys, they don't die. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. How's Giles fended him off? I mean, he's good in combat, actually, isn't he? But these boys would be really good. <laughs> Sandra as well. What the fuck? I feel like they're going to get the better of them and maybe show them mercy. Teach us how we should have done it. Oh shit! What's he like when he is evil? <laughs> Help the others! <laughs> With the shovels. <laughs> oh, Giles! Oh shit! Someone help him! Oh. oh, they can bleed. Your knife can kill you. Oh, his knife, okay. Oh, oh shit! Turn into a bear. <laughs> you made a bear. <laughs> you made a bear. Undo it. Undo it. <laughs> Undo it. <laughs> this is hilarious with Spike. Tell the others to get the knives off him. Oh, shit. <laughs> hey, General Ben, over here. Is that? <laughs> He's suicidal, Xander. That's forgiving me, syphilis. <laughs> Gonna rip you apart. Okay. So what happens? They disappear. Oh, they all disappear. Oh, was that like the 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 first guy, the main villain? I say villain. We're the villains, really. <laughs> that was an eventful Thanksgiving. Now for the food. <laughs> oh. Is she not seen him? He stayed outside, did he? Oh, I thought they were gonna. Oh. Oh, too late, Buffy. Oh, that was really good. Did we win? <laughs> we now. <laughs> He's got a place at the table. Two seconds of conflict with an indigenous person, and I, I turn into General Custer. <laughs> violence does that, you know. Instinct takes over. Yeah. Survival That's instinct, fun. really. That's the fun. Nobody asked you. <laughs> An entire siege. I think one of you would bleed a little. Buffy bled, right? I don't think she's going to feed him there. Wasn't exactly a perfect Thanksgiving. Mm. Bunch of anticipation, a big fight, now we're all sleepy. <laughs> and we did all survive. Is that how they go down normally? 
Sounds like Christmas. I think my syphilis is clearing right up. Oh yeah. And they say romance. Not the dinner table. Yeah. <laughs> or maybe they just wish it. It was like old times. Yeah, especially with Angel being here mm. and everything. Oh shit. Look at Spike. Look at the way Spike's looking at her. Somebody said something there. I missed it. Hold on. Let me rewind it. I spoke over that. I think somebody said something. Hold on. Oops. Okay. That must have been uh, Xander. It was kind of random and it wasn't the best episode ever, but it was really good at the same time. I feel that way about this show a lot, actually. There are such great episodes that when it's not one of those, you kind of feel like it's not the greatest episode. But I always love it. I always enjoy it. And it was really good, actually. I think it was a good episode, but at the same time, there's been much, much better episodes in terms of like how the episode's constructed, you know, and but I really enjoyed this one. I found it really, really funny. And it's kind of weird to say that given the, the subject, right? It's kind of hard. Um, it's hard to laugh at it, but we weren't laughing at what happened where we were just laughing at the jokes, of course. But yeah, it, it's also hard for me because I, I'm not from the US culture. So, I mean, I know a little bit about it, but not a lot. I mean, everyone watching this will know much more. We don't learn about that at school at all in the UK. We don't learn about our empire either. <laughs> not, probably not surprisingly, given what we did. Yeah, I mean, I say we. I'm mostly Irish genetically, but yeah, I mean, the Irish were ruled by Britain, so they were kind of in on it, but involuntarily, so I don't know how to feel. Yeah, so Spike is kind of in with the gang in a way, in this episode at least. I don't think he's going to stick around. I imagine at some point he's going to get cured from this like they're, well, they're going to find the implant they're going to find a way to take it out i mean not the gang obviously why would they do that no one but another vampire or demon is going to help him i think he said right that if a vampire doesn't get fed they live did he say they live forever as a skeleton or something like that we haven't seen that he's gonna to have to get some blood up from somewhere right because he's looking really bad isn't he he looked worse than xander actually Xander looked pretty bad, but that was funny with Xander and, and their argument as well. It's like the weirdest couple argument ever, that that scene. That was hilarious. It was so nice to see Angel again in Buffy. It was really nice, even though, I mean, she knows now, doesn't she? Xander let it out of the bag, but typical Xander. But just to see him with the others, right? With Giles, with um, Willow, with Z Xander as well. And to meet Anya as well. That was good. Anya was quite intrigued by him, wasn't she? As much as I wanted him to meet Buffy again, I really wanted that. As much as I wanted that, it is better, actually, that they didn't because it keeps it hanging there, doesn't it? I suspect we're going to get that eventually and it'll make it an even bigger moment, won't it? And also the fact that he was there and they didn't tell her, that'll be good for the next episode to see how she takes that, to see how she feels about it. Not just that they didn't tell her and they should have told her, but also the fact that she knows now that he was there and he didn't make himself known to her. And yeah, she's just going to bring it all back to her, isn't it? And, and we learned that Angel, I mean, we know Angel still cares about it. Of course, we saw the, he keeps the picture in the book in the last episode of Angel, the, the, the uh, one of the first scenes. So it's not a surprise that he still cares about her, of course, but he really deeply cares about her still, doesn't he? Almost like he wants to get back with her, but he knows he can't. So it's hard for him, of course, and that's why he stayed away. But also, yeah, he didn't want to distract her. It's a really good thing they've done there, actually. I like it that she's aware that Angel was there and just the whole thing of they, that they could meet again, you know, how's, how's that going to work? And the fact that they can't be together, but they still want to, really, don't they? It's, it's really good. I really like it, the way they've done it and the way they did it in this episode. I really enjoyed it. And yeah, that ending just made it, didn't it? Okay, well, I enjoyed it. I thought it was good. I'm going to give this one an 8.5, I think. I think I'll give it an 8.5. I really enjoyed it. It was good. Um, yeah, and we'll see what happens in Angel next because that's what the one I'm going to do next. This next Angel uh, episode, episode 8, has been recommended to me. So it must be related to Buffy, I imagine, because I think it was the important ones that were recommended in terms of like the important ones relating to Buffy as Buffy is the one I'm putting up onto YouTube every episode. Um, yeah, but it will go up onto YouTube, that episode. I'll do a reaction to it. I'm about to film it and we'll see. So thanks for watching this one and hopefully you'll join me for that one. If not, 
hopefully you'll join me for episode nine of Buffy something blue okay oh is there a wedding maybe you could oh, don't tell me it's Sandra and um Anya <laughs> it could be she could get him down the aisle though the way she's acting um yeah but this next angel episode I will remember you hopefully you'll join me for either one of those two and I'll see you for whichever one you just join me for thanks for watching this one and yeah see ya bye